My name is Plana Yvette Discalyar. Welcome to my humble town, Maribohok. Maribohok is a coastal town and is known as the fishing village of the southwestern part of Bohol. It is at approximately 14 kilometers away from the province capital, Tagbilaran City. My town offers a panoramic view of the neighboring island, Cebu province, and has its own path of cultural and natural heritages that it can be proud of. The town was said to be named after a tree which resembles a pine tree named Agoho, whose leaves look like hairs but thicker and firmer compared to the former. History claims that the original name of the municipality is said to be Lungkuan, a word that means place of anchorage derived from the old port located at the shore of the bay where sailors used to land and engage business with the early settlers. A part of it, there are three strong points why Maribok has its best. First, it is diverse culture and tradition. Second, it is rich history. And lastly, it's breathtaking and eye-catching tourist destination. As a tourism graduate, I work in the tourism industry as a frontliner and we support and promote green tourism for ecological conservation and sustainable tourism. As a tourism advocate, this drives me to promote my advocacy which is the Firefly Sanctuary Protection and Preservation in Abatan River. The Abatan River is one of the rivers in our country where biodiversity is rich. The river was enticingly lined with palm trees and mangroves. With its calmness and tranquility, together with its deep emerald waters, the river is truly inviting. Abatan River is home to over 31 of the 44 mangrove species found in the Philippines making it one of the country's most diverse mangrove forests. Mangroves are important to the environment for sheltering young fish, protecting against floods, and absorbing carbon, among other things. One manifestation of its richness in the existence of different species of fireflies. These fireflies are found in temperate and tropical climates just like our country. Up close to the trees, the unmistakable dance of life plays out. Hundreds of fireflies float between the leaves, blinking amorous flushes of gold to one another. This is one of the nature's most bewitching spectacles in Abatan River. The kayaking and mangrove firefly watching. Here in the heart of Bohol's black night, these tiny little creatures keep the darkness at bay. One of the pressing issues that the locals are facing right now is the risk of losing one of the rarest species on the planet, the fireflies. As long as we keep interrupting their colony, using motorboats instead of kayak, and destruction of their habitat, the fewer fly flies there will be. Motorboats are wrecking havoc of the Batan's ecosystem. It creates waves that cause the water to bob up and down, chipping away at these delicate firefly nurseries. It also accelerates erosion of mud underneath the trees where fireflies develop. This is something that tourists who take the motorboats do not see. We should be aware of the importance of the river to the livelihood of the community. The activities in Abatan like kayaking and nipa touching prove to be a good source of additional income for the community. The local guides in Abatan River help sustain the local community who work together to protect the fireflies, river and its mangroves. It is through them that the community lives. Your experience here is nothing short of magical. A magic brought to life not just by the river's natural beauty but also by the locals' hard work and determination for the protection of the river, their home. Connoting the five hours of our town has been doing drives in order to protect the Firefly Sanctuary. 
First, rethink. The local government unit of Maribuhok has been conducting symposiums about the importance of preserving the sanctuary. Second, reuse. The use of alternatives, such as eco bags, have been greatly imposed in our town to lessen the waste from plastics. Third, reduce. To preserve the Firefly Sanctuary, we should limit its exposure to the people by putting specific time with a specific number of visitors. Fourth, recycle. 60 to 80 percent of the things wasted in our world can be recycled. Thus, we should be creative enough to maximize and recycle waste for humanity and for our Earth. And lastly, but the most important, respect. I always believe in the saying that destroying our environment is killing our humanity. Thus, we should respect the existence of fireflies by protecting their sanctuary for them to reproduce. As an echo warrior, it is a long time and it is very necessary to protect the environment and save the whole mankind. It is important to protect the environment because man-made disruptions to ecosystem can cause extinction because pollution can cause dangers to both humans and animals, and because mankind owes to the natural world a moral obligation. That is why I am advocating the Firefly Sanctuary Protection and Preservation here in Abatan River before it's too late. Lastly, let us create a rifle effect of goodness to our home, Mother Earth, for the benefit of humanity. I am Flana Yvette Discalyar, Miss Philippines Earth Bohal, proudly representing from the premier eco-tourism destination of Bohal, Maribohal, and I am a woman of the earth.